The endometrium is the inside lining of the uterus. An endometrial biopsy is the removal of a sample of tissue from the endometrium for testing. A biopsy may be done to screen for cancer or precancerous cells, to determine the cause of irregular bleeding, or to investigate fertility problems. This procedure can also check for infections and monitor the effectiveness of certain medications. An endometrial biopsy can be done in your doctor's office in 10 to 15 minutes without the use of a sedative. Your doctor will first do a manual exam to determine the position of your uterus and then place a speculum in your vagina to open it up and keep it open so the cervix is visible. Your doctor may use another instrument called a tenaculum to grasp the cervix and hold it steady during the procedure. Your doctor will then pass a long, thin, flexible tube called a pipel through your vagina and cervix and into your uterus. The pipel is equipped with a piston-like device that creates suction when pulled. Your doctor will spin the pipel and move it up and down in the uterus while suctioning up an adequate sample of endometrial tissue. Then remove the pipel and place its contents in a container. Your doctor will complete the procedure by removing the tenaculum and speculum. After the biopsy, some patients are able to sit up immediately and feel minimal cramping. Others who may feel some dizziness will be asked to lie still for about 10 to 15 minutes before being released. An anti-inflammatory medication such as ibuprofen or naproxen is often prescribed to minimize any menstrual-like cramping or discomfort. Your doctor will send the sample to the lab for testing. Results may be given to you by telephone or during a follow-up appointment with your physician.